in search of myself and that was one of the greatest penetrating discoveries every greatest saint rishis maharishis go through just to find out what they are and one of the greatest maharishis of india ramana maharishi said ask who am i and the messiah of the christian world said knock and you can find yourself knock and the door shall be open and people thought it was somebody else's door it was your door and once you find your strength i think there won't be any diseases or pain in the society the first series of the bull the ten bulls one the search for the bull in the pasture of this world i endlessly push aside the tall grasses in search of the bull following unnamed rivers lost upon the interpenet interpenetrating paths of distant mountains <clears throat> my strength failing and my vitality exhausted i cannot find the bull i only hear the locust chirring through the forest at night everybody goes through this one when they go to the marry they wanted to marry the girl they wanted to marry the boy and this was created to make sure that somebody is in charge of the society one two the ancient or our ancestors believed that the search will be very beautiful if a marriage can happen otherwise in olden days there was no more marriages all children have got uncles and uh, aunt is no father and mother the later on when the marriage system came there is very beautiful in the pastures of this world i endlessly push aside the tall grasses in search of the bull they're all pushing aside searching for something and that something was that girl that something was that boy the opposite sex and once that girl or the boy is given into your hands you feel so happy and in that happiness you forget to relate you forget to understand every part it is very good if you get lost in that penetrating happiness but instead you put your borrowed knowledge try to grab try to possess try to slave try to destroy the opposite sex this were not your own it was all borrowed knowledge forced into you through your disciplines of your so called school teachings colleges universities continued for you to get into a slave trade of getting a job and there also you continue to slave your employees and at home with all this travel you lost in the pastures of this world i endlessly push aside the tall grasses in search of the bull the bull means search of yourself you are going outside following unnamed rivers lost upon the inter penetrating paths of the distant mountains in search of money in search of greed in search of egoistic and unnecessarily getting trapped with the remote control of competition competitive competition success competitive exams competitive 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 so that you forget the more the people ask for intelligence literacy the devil outside the monarchs outside the rulers outside understood give them more but let them not have it let them start chasing it and keep on allowing them to chase the best method to make them chase is the competitive exams the schools the colleges but now you we are you and we are all trapped 
in this vicious circle of competition to destroy us, make us nobody, so that the rulers will enjoy with all the best facilities. One politician, I asked him, why don't you go for a job or do some business? And that person told me, Rakumji, why should I go for a job or for a business? I'm a politician. I don't need that. Money comes of its own from different sources. I have to only make them run. And when they are in trouble, create trouble for them and they run. You have the money coming into your pockets. I cannot find the bull. I only hear the locusts churring through the forest at night. So what you people can do is when you go to the schools or universities, Yes. It is like a girl and a boy for your opposite sex. You going there to uh, understand, to penetrate, to feel the happiness. And once you understood that, you understand, you turn back to look your strength. Because it is if you don't give your strength to them, they will be lost. And that was the trouble. Turn back to look into your strength. You find your strength is so beautiful. You try to make it, you try to pedicure and manicure your strength. You try to make it so flowery, so poetic, so philosophic. And when you make your physical body looking so poetical with no excess fat, only visceral, Skeletal muscle, you automatically you know the power is boom, boom going. And when you find the opposite sex, you will be able to give. And in the giving, you have got a lot of unimaginable, what do you call it, satoris. Variety is a satoris which leads you to enlightenment. That was the strength of a master. Do not forget every child, every student of the university, every IAS officers, IPS officers, including ministers or MLS. You have another one leader called the central command, the high command, who is controlling to make you a nobody. Please look into your strength. When you understand the strength, you intend to go to spread the fragrance. You try to drop your fruits in every in front of every house. Yes. You try to make as many friends as possible. You allow as many friends as possible. The wind to penetrate into your beautiful trees. The sunlight to fall every part of you. The sunlight are the huge masses which is staying around you. Once you know the strength, you don't fear. Strength means the beauty of yourself, which you make sure that it is updated, cleansed. Yes, before you start your day, you cleanse through your pranayama, through your yoga exercises, through your stretching exercises, through your laughter, through your bhajans, through your deepa, through the Shastanga Namaskara to all the elders and you do the Shastanga Namaskara not only to elders to the earth when you go flat into the earth the earth the mud absorbs all your poisons from your body not in the concrete jungle if you are in the concrete jungle yes try to escape from the concrete jungle once in a while that is the beauty in the search for the bull Ramana Maharshi said, ask who am I? The power is inside you. Once you understood that power, you can see the cup is always empty. In that emptiness, you find satoris and satoris of truth. And inside the truth is God. The search for the bull in the pastures of this world. That is the money, the style. All that is for you to... Watch not to possess. I endlessly push aside the tall grasses in search of the world. You don't have to search for yourself by pushing aside people. Following unnamed rivers lost upon the interpenetrating parts of the distant mountains. Just enjoy the mountains, but don't go and search for some truth over there. My strength 
failing and my vitality exhausted. Yes. Once you go and search for somebody, you lose your strength. You get exhausted. In that exhausted state, you will be forced to meet the doctor, whatever money you have saved it. In that exhaustion, you will be forced to borrow money. That is called, you start buying things when we don't have money to, and then you pay EMI. A slave money for the people. Yes, EMI. Loans, stop it. Stop it for God's sake if you wanted to find the truth. I cannot find the bull. Yes, you will not find yourself because somebody else is controlling you in the name of EMI and loans and jobs. If you go for jobs or the factories, never mind. Find out what is the best in that beautiful girl or man and then come back and understand yours and you can give more than what they are giving you or what you have seen it, what you have felt it. I only hear the locusts churning through the forest at night. Yes, you will only hear. But you will never understand if you start chasing somebody in search of myself.